live with their reaction tonight. Melissa. Well, Tracy, that girl is now a woman and her name is Ashley Summers and her story is very similar to that of Amanda and Gina as uh, she went missing as a teenager in this same area around the same time, just within a couple years. She had a tattoo on her arm with, um, I think it was a heart with the word Jean inscribed in it. For the family of Ashley Summers, a West Side teenager who vanished almost six years ago, Monday's announcement that three missing women were found alive hit home. I was uh, just overwhelmed with emotion, just uh, just cried tears basically of joy, just because in un disbelief that it was just so amazing to hear that they were found. Summers was only 14 years old when she disappeared back in 2007 from the same Cleveland neighborhood as Amanda Berry, Gina De Jesus, and Michelle Knight. So where is she? The last time was six years ago, and um, they had a confirmed report from somebody that she was in an apartment that was uh, um, housed by a known pimp. So that's why we really believe she's trafficked. According to her grandmother, Ashley was presumed to have run away from home after a fight, but was never seen or heard from again. I also believe that we, uh, myself and my husband, saw her walking down Lorraine Avenue with her hair cut and because she stared right in our car and by the time I got turned around, she had disappeared down an alley. Ashley will be 20 years old this June and now the Summers family can only hope that the investigation into the three women's decade long captivity will somehow lead them to Ashley. People need to be aware of their surroundings, aware of what's going on in their own neighborhoods even, um, and just be willing to step in and help somebody who is yelling for help and willing to be there to be that hero for somebody that's in trouble. Another Summers family just wanting to get this information out as much as possible. So to recap, she's about foot five foot five, brown hair, blue eyes, and has a tattoo on one of her arms. That's a heart with the word Jean inscribed on it. Bill and Tracy, they're hoping that people.